friends. I am in my dining room today and I kind of went down a little bit of a wormhole. So I was nosing around at Tuesday morning and uh, I went over in the depart their drapery department and they had several panels of really kind of cool looking curtains. So I got these and they are a a faux linen with a pinch pleat top, and I love that pinch pleat, but it's actually got a tab on the back. So that is like super, it's gonna look super good. But anyway, my dilemma is 18 year old curtains. They are eggplant velvet. You know, I was always doing the, the golds and the eggplants and the darker tones in here. And just, you know, it's spring. It's, it, we, I want to lighten things up a little bit. These things are old. They're faded on the, on the side that gets the sun. And it's been time for years. I just haven't really put the effort into it. I really even knew what I wanted to do. So bonus, these little panels were only 25 bucks for, for uh, two panels. So I needed two sets of them. So for a little over $50, I'm gonna do new window treatments for my dining room. And the only thing is I normally go really tall with my drapes because I've got my hutch over here with my grandmother's china and all that stuff and they're bigger pieces. But for this particular um, drapery, I want to kind of bring the rod down and in. These are 96 um, length and these are 84s that I'm going to go ahead. I could have gone back up with the bigger ones again, but I just kind of feel like I want to bring things back to a normal size here just because they're so light and airy. Um, I'm not sure if I'm making a mistake or not, but I won't know until I get them done, right? So I'm going to uh, take these, these guys down. 18 years old and then I am going to move the curtain rod down and then I will hang these they're light they're neutral they're really pretty they're kind of like a, a real creamy real light beige color a little off-white neutral that I love so much so we'll see how it works stay tuned we're going to take this curtain rod holder down and I'm going to go ahead and bring it to uh, more of a scale over here to frame the window with those new drapes. Well, that broke. Looks like I'm going to the store to get a new curtain rod. <laughs> Stay tuned. So I'm just hanging the new curtain rod up. I broke the other one, the darn thing, but that's okay. Out with the old, in with the new. I gotta bring it in a little closer because I don't want it to be, you know, the other one was way out here and way up there, and that's just a little bit too much for these curtains. So I'm just gonna go ahead and, go and tuck this one in a little closer. Okay, look at these. So the back, they have a tab, but in the front, they look like a pinch pleat. And I love that. I love that look. So I'm gonna go ahead and just pop the other two panels on, and then we'll get them hung, and then I'll get them steamed, and then we're done. See, so here we've got this. So let's get these guys up, yay! I love the pinch pleats, you guys. I just think they're awesome. They look like, a, a, like more of a formal drape, but they're so, sheer i'll snip those tags off um i just love that look i think we got something good this is awesome okay i am gonna hang i am gonna put the other center support up it's wanting to sag a little bit that's a long rod so that's the other one's gonna go right in here and then we're done Okay guys, so I am going to take down the tie back holders. These curtains are really sheer and they really don't need to be held back. So I'm gonna take these down and you know I'm gonna save this, this video, because I'm gonna use it for something. It's either gonna be on top of the tray or it's gonna be on top of a bird feeder or a birdhouse or something. But these things will get used in a project. I just know it, I think they're adorable. So let's get this guy off the wall. Ta-da! There's the new drapes. I love them so much. They're sheer. 
it's the perfect little um, addition to lighten things up in this room. You know, you can peek out there and you can still see my front porch, which really is one of my favorite parts about the whole house. Um, look out there, you can see my flag and you can see my rockers and that just makes me so happy. So now you guys see that you can do these little projects and it really, okay, 50 bucks for the curtain, um, less than $20 for the curtain rods. So we're in this thing, just a little over $70 with tax and everything. And that's a bargain. That's a good deal. And I love them. I love the pinch pleat tops that just really finishes it off the way that I wanted it. And considering I, I wasn't even really looking for this when I went out and gallivanting, but I'm glad I found it. So Tuesday morning for the win.